how can i avoid any tragedies in my life there was a woman named uh, kisa uh, she was a disciple of lord buddha and every day she would come to uh, buddha and sit by his feet and listen to his teachings uh, as uh, a fate would have it she became uh, pregnant and she had a child and a few months after the child was born the child died the child became ill and and he died and the mother of course was distraught she brought the dead baby in her arms to lord buddha and weeping and crying and full of grief and she laid the child in front of uh, lord buddha and uh, told him you have divine powers you are the great one if you want with your power and your place of blessings you can again give life to this child Uh, Lord Buddha looked at the child and the mother, and he also had a lot of sympathy and grief for the mother. And he told the mother, "I will see what I can do, but can you bring me?" a handful of mustard seeds the mother said yes sure i can the buddha laid one condition that it must come from a house where no one has died she so she went to the village from house to house and the first house they said alas my grandfather died my grandfather died here the second house she went oh my mother passed away last year the third house she went my cousin was visiting 2 years ago and she died here so like this each and every house she went she realized there has been there is no house in the village untouched by tragedy so the realization dawned on her that tragedy is something that visits all of us and none of our none of us are immune from it we will lose our parents or our grandparents or those whom those we love and tragedy at some point in time or another will befall us once this realization came to her she cremated her child went back to lord buddha and became his disciple for life so i think this story aptly explains that there's no one even our great saints and prophets and sufis have not been immune from tragedy there is no one who is immune from tragedy and can live a tragedy filled a free life we just need to handle how to handle tragedy which probably is another question to be answered in a subsequent video so if you would like to leave a feedback or ask a question please leave on this page thank you for watching this video